Planting native hedging is one of the best ways to increase biodiversity, create wildlife corridors and is also a great alternative to fencing. All sorts of wildlife from birds to butterflies depend on hedges. Here's a closer look at one example. Hawthorn is a common hedge species, recognisable here by its distinctive leaves and characteristic red fruits known as haws. Hawthorn can support over 300 insect species as well as small mammals and birds. Hazel can be easily recognised by its soft, downy leaves. The hazelnuts ripen late in the summer and are enjoyed by squirrels, hazel dormice and humans alike. The almond scented flowers of bird cherry provide an excellent early source of nectar and pollen for pollinators. The cherries are also eaten by birds and small mammals. The leaves of the crab apple are food for caterpillars of many moths, including green pug, Chinese character and pale tussock. The apples can be made into a great jam and are also enjoyed by mice, voles, foxes and badgers. Elder is another favourite of foragers as the flowers make an excellent cordial. The flowers also provide nectar for a variety of insects and the berries are eaten by birds and small mammals. Blackthorn is one of the first trees to flower and provides a valuable source of nectar and pollen for bees in the spring. Its leaves are a food plant for caterpillars of moss such as magpie and swallowtailed as well as hair streak butterflies. Many birds nest among the dense, thorny thickets, eating caterpillars and other insects from the leaves and feasting on slowberries in the autumn. It's important to include native shrubs such as this dog rose in your head. The spring flowers are an important nectar source for insects and its fruits, known as hips, are a food source for birds such as blackbirds, redwings and waxwings. Brambles are a familiar sight in hedges. Look out for their juicy blackberries in late summer. Brambles provide an important source of nectar for brimstone and speckled wood butterflies, fruits for song thrushes and yellow hammers, and hiding places for hedgehogs and dormice. A healthy native hedge will have ground cover plants such as wildflowers like primrose and herb robert, as well as ferns and grasses. Common plants like nettles are often overlooked, but they are in fact great wildlife attractors. Caterpillars of small tortoise shell and peacock butterflies use them as food plants. Ladybirds feast on the aphids that shelter among them, and seed-eating birds enjoy their autumn spoils. Good management of your hedge should include leaving strips of longer grass at the base, as well as trimming and laying the hedge when necessary. Larger trees can also be incorporated as part of a healthy native hedge.